Hey guys, Michael from Copper vs Glass, and in today's video we're going to be taking a look at my EDC, or Everyday Carry. Now this is also going to be my last video of 2020, so if you guys enjoyed this video be sure to give it a thumbs up down below, and here is to a better 2021. Let's take a look. So first up guys, we have my over-ear headphones of choice, and now the Bose QC35 version 2. Now with the QC35s, you get some really awesome features. You get three levels of noise cancelling. So again, if you don't want to cancel out everything, you've got the option to change it up. You've also then got the Google Assistant built right into the headphones as well. So again, it's super easy to get access to your Google Assistant and do anything that you would do on your phone using the headphones. You've also got a really awesome music share option with the Bose Connect application. And you've got around 20 hours of battery life, which is actually really great to see on a pair of headphones like this. Now, yes, the battery life isn't going to be as good when you're using noise cancelling, but it's good you can get through a long flight, for example, without having to worry about the overall battery life. You've also got all the buttons that you need on the outside in regards to skipping tracks, play, pause, turning on or off noise cancelling, you've got everything that you need. They are also extremely comfortable as well, you've got a really nice cushion here on the actual headpiece and on the top band as well, so if you're going to be using these for long listening sessions you're not really going to have too much of a problem. They're also quite light as well for wireless headphones, so again in regards to those longer listening sessions, I use them to edit YouTube videos for example, I'm not having any issues at all, I can spend hours and hours with these headphones and they don't really hurt your head, ears or feel that uncomfortable. Now the one thing that I'm not a huge fan of and I really wish they would change is the fact that it uses micro USB to charge. Now yes this is an older pair of headphones, the newer version of the Bose headphones do have USB type C but for me with the specific model I'm not a huge fan of having to carry around a second cable. Pretty much all of my tech including my hard drive, phone, iPad, earbuds, they all use USB type C so to carry around that extra little cable isn't necessarily the best thing. Now I'm also filming this video on the day that Apple have announced their AirPod Max headphones and they're coming in at around £549 here in the UK. Yes, we're going to have to see exactly how they sound. They do look quite nice, but in regards to the price to performance ratio, they need to be extremely good headphones for that money. Next up then, and something maybe a little bit random to some people, but it is a portable SSD. Now this comes from RAV Power, it's a solid state drive, and it's got some really great features, and I use it pretty much on a daily basis. Now the read and write speed is going to be around 540 megabytes per second, it's got one terabyte worth of storage, and it's got a really nice metal design to it as well. It's made of really nice aluminium on one side and a nice rubbery texture here on the back. Overall it feels extremely nice, it's very small, very pocketable, and really easy to carry around. It also uses USB Type-C, which is really good to see on these sorts of USB drives, and it is USB 3.1, and the great thing about it is you can use it on pretty much anything that has a USB connection. Connection. I can use it on my Mac for video editing for example, you can even plug it into an Xbox to power your games and the speeds that it's got is fast enough that it's not going to cause any problems like maybe some other hard drives that you can buy for games consoles. So overall if you're looking for a very small, light and slim SSD, RAV Power definitely has you covered. Next up then we have my wireless earbuds of choice and they are the LG Tone Free FN6. Now while the name may be a bit of a mouthful, the headphones themselves are extremely good. You've got a really awesome UV cleaning so that when you actually take the headphones in and out of the case, it's going to kill around 99% of bacteria which is really great considering what's going on at the moment. You've got 18 hours of battery life, you can also download the tone free application so that you can do things like changing the EQ for pretty much any sound profile that you like or you can create a custom one and you can also change what the buttons do when you tap, long press and double press on the actual earbuds themselves. They are also IPX4 rated so again if you're going to be using these while working out you're not going have a problem at all and they've also got USB type C and also wireless charging which is really awesome because my phone of choice which we'll get onto in just a moment also has reverse wireless charging allowing me to actually charge these earbuds on the back of my phone which is really great when you're out and about and need a little bit of charge in a pinch. And next up then is something super minimal that I carry with me every single day and that is going to be my Ridge wallet. Now I've done previous videos in the past where Ridge have actually sponsored the video. This video is completely unsponsored. This is just stuff that I use on a daily basis but this is one that they sent me out quite a long time ago and it has held up extremely well and like I say I use it on pretty much a daily basis. 
It's got a very simple design. You've got a lot of designs to choose from. You can also add certain things like a money clip to the back, for example, and it holds between one and 12 cards, comes with a lifetime warranty, and also has some really awesome RFID blocking technology on board, so you're not gonna have any issues with any of your information being stolen. Now, I've also got in here two cards, which is actually gonna give you a 10% discount as well. So I'm gonna put those on screen. So if you head over to the Ridge Wallet website, you will be able to get 10% off of your order but it is going to be on a first come first serve basis. Next up then we have something that I carry with me every single day and that is actually my watch. Now this is a Daniel Wellington and it's a classic Sheffield design. Now I really like this design because it is super slim, you've got a 40mm watch face and just in general the black on gold combination is extremely nice. Now the watch band itself is just a third party watch band that I got off Amazon for I think around £11 or so so you can switch out the watch bands as and when you need to but overall this is one of my favourite pieces of kind of non-tech I suppose you could say because again it's just a watch not a smart watch doesn't do anything special but it just has a really nice classic timeless design we then have my tablet of choice and that is going to be the ipad pro 11 inch from 2018 now I use this iPad for every single video that I do here on YouTube. It can have notes on it, a full blown script, and I also edit all of the thumbnails within the actual iPad using Photoshop or Snapseed to get a really nice look to the photos. Now I do also use an Apple Pencil, but it's not an official Apple Pencil. This is a third party Apple Pencil that actually does a really good job and works in pretty much the exact same way that the official Apple one does and is way cheaper than what you're gonna pay. So again, that's gonna be linked in the description. I can highly recommend it because you don't really lose out on any features at all the one annoying thing is again usb and it's going to be micro and then lastly we have my daily driver which of course is the google pixel 5 now i have done a ton of videos here on the pixel 5 with regards to how it is for gaming camera samples full-blown reviews and also a one month later video all of which are going to be linked in that description below but safe to say this is actually one of my favorite android phones in a long time the 90 hertz refresh rate and the screen itself looks really nice the camera of course is amazing and you do now have that wide angle lens and the 765g chip doesn't really give any issues day to day it can still play some AAA games at 90 hertz which is really nice to see and high graphics usb-c fast charging reverse wireless charging and the design itself is really nice as well but again i've done a ton of videos about that and if you want to see a full review that is linked in the description down below and that's actually going to do it guys for this video on my everyday carry items now yes i don't have everything with me at any one time but when i leave the house i'm going to have a combination of three to four of these items with me so that gives you a good idea in regards to how and when i'm going to be using them however i use pretty much all of them on a weekly basis at least and yes i switch between maybe over ear and in-ear headphones i may not take out my wallet for example because i can use google pay on my phone but overall i use a combination of everything and and it's all going to be linked in that description down below and like i mentioned this is actually going to be my last video of 2020. now 2021 is going to be an amazing year we're going to do a massive brand redesign refresh everything new graphics maybe even a little bit of a different setup here in the background so if you're not already subscribed now is a great time to do so 2020 hasn't necessarily been the best year but for me here on youtube you guys have been amazing in regards to support views, comments, thumbs up, and the love on the channel here has been incredible, so thank you very much, and I'll see you guys in 2021 with a bunch of new content. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to leave a thumbs up down below. If you are already subscribed, don't forget to turn on notifications so you're notified any time I post a new video here on the channel. I'm Michael from Copper vs Glass. Thanks very much for watching, and I will catch you guys in the new year.